Fuck off. No. Oh. That was fucking close. Okay. Jesus Christ. This is getting fucking hairy. Very fucking hairy. Come on, Leon. Go, 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 go. Come on, you fucking blonde fucking stallion. Let's go. Come on, come on. You're not far from the safe room. It's just downstairs. <laughs> I probably should have packed more fucking healing items with me, but I didn't actually expect to get fucking battered by Mr. Fucking DMC. X go give it to you. Fucking dirty bastard, right? Shit, 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 shit. Okay, we're, I think we're in the clear. I think we're fine. <sighs> Leon fucking white in. Okay. <laughs> Fuck me, that that was pretty fucking hairy, that was. That got quite fucking insane. Right. I'm gonna go... I'll just use the first aid spray, because I don't want to use any herbs right now. So, right, I'm gonna go save. But there's one more thing I need to do before we leave the RPD. I'm pretty sure there's another knife around here somewhere as well. So I'm gonna go try and find that. Stick that in there. Okay, I need to go get the box so I can get the Magnum. Let's just go do that. Because the Magnum will, will will really... Actually, I'll take a healing item with me as well. Uh, I'll take... I'll take a fucking... Take some herbs with me, go on. There we go. Okay, right, sick. Let's go. Because um, I don't want to get fucking barred by Mr. X again. So... We need to go upstairs. Ooh, no, there's some ammo over here as well, actually. Hang on. I always forget that there is, like, ammo around here as well. There we go. So, I think we've got amassed quite a fair bit of ammo, to be honest. Again, I'm trying not to use as much of it as humanly possible, because, yeah, it just, it just bones you. Oh, go away! Leave me- Oh, fuck it, right, I'll go through this way. Cock it. Cock it! Cock it! Fuck, 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 fuck. Right, Marvin, you better not be around that you are there, okay? <laughs> um. Shit, 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 shit. Ugh. Oh my god. It's funny as well, because Mr. X in this acts more like Nemesis than actual Nemesis does, which I think is kind of hilarious. I'll take that as well. Might need that, right? A liquor is gonna try and fuck us up when we do this, but it's fine. We can, we should be able to deal with him. We should just be able to avoid him. You don't really need to attack him. I don't think he really blocks your way or anything. Okay. There we go. And we got the fucking jewel. Cock and jewel, mate. All right, there we go. Whoa! Shit! I am out of here. Bye bye. I ain't fighting you. Right. Grab this fucking jewel. And then, uh, we'll go get the fucking... The cock in Magnum. And then get the fuck out of here. <laughs> that's what we need to do. Go away! Leave me alone! Oh, right, okay, fuck it. We're going to flank him. Come on! Shit. Wait. No, you ugly... Fucking bastard, man. Leave me alone. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Jesus Christ. He just pure fucks you up, he does, Mr. X. It's fucking ridiculous, right? Oh. None of those shots touch them at all. No! Oh. Go away! <laughs> Shit, should have took the fucking stun with me. Cock. I love how none of those shotgun shots hit either of them. Fucking brilliant. Story of my fucking life, that is. Okay. Oh, cock. Oh, right, okay. Die. Let's go get fucking flashbangs. 
because I can I can immobilize Mr. X pretty quickly and not have to worry too much. I'm just debating whether to put my shot. I'm gonna put my shotgun back in here just now. All right, take that. I'm gonna need those. All right, because I ideally want to just get the Magnum and get the fuck out of there really as quickly as possible. Do you know what actually, I'll do. I'll just get take the Magnum and then we'll just go straight downstairs. Because there's a. Oh no no, no. we'll have to fucking come back actually. Because you can't. Yeah shit. Okay never mind. I keep thinking there's like a there's a fucking box in the in the actual like hall, but it's not. Right. Well, not in this scenario anyway. The first scenario there is, but not in the second. Okay. Stick that fucking USB in. Oh no, I don't want to take it right now. But I remember to actually take it with me as well. Because um, it's good to take it with you because you can then get the Magnum parts later on. Right, there we go. Nice. Got the fucking Magnum. There we go. Right, let's get the fuck out of here. I can hear his fucking massive lumbering steps. But it'll be fine. We can deal with this. <laughs> we got this. Okay. No, I need to go this way, don't I? Because I need to get the medallions. Let me get the fuck out of Dodge. Go flap to him. Alright, that's it. Fuck you. Yeah, that's it. Stick it. Cunt. Huh. Yeah, now we. You're gonna fucking. You know, milady anyone else now? You fucking fedora wearing cunt. Ha! <laughs> Wait. Ah, oh, shit, 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 shit. I see him coming to fucking leather me now because I fucking shot his fucking fedora off. Right. Don't, I don't think I'm going to need any of those. Ooh, I should not put that in there. Put that in there as well. Sick, right. Let's get out of here. <laughs> no, go away. Please. Just give me a chance. I don't think there's any other knives anywhere. Fucking hell. Fuck off. Right, there we go. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get the fuck out of here. Right, stick on the lion medallion. And stick on the unicorn. Don't even really. I was gonna say I've pushed it down the water path. Fucking really mad. And then finally. The Maiden. Right, let's get the fuck out of here. Let's get out of this fucking RPD. Do I think, um, I'm pretty sure Mr. X can come in here as well, I'm pretty sure. I'm sure there's one time where I, uh, I was, I was running away from Mr. X and he came in here and I was like, holy shit. Alright, we'll stick, okay, so we'll stick that in there. Now, this is where we're gonna fight Birkin, uh, in his G1 form, so I'm gonna save real quick. And then we'll go, go fucking leather him. Go kick his cunt in. Do him in. Fucking let it in, mate. Right. So, we need to take this out and that out. I will take the first aid spray. And then... I think I'll... That should do me for now, I think. Yeah, I think I should do me for now. Right, before I go and do any of this, I'm gonna go have a fucking whiz, so BRB. Okay, I'm back, right? I'm back from the fucking, my massive fucking fat wires. So, we need to go take on Birkin and fuck him up. And uh, you'll be wondering why I've only got the the knives and the, the fucking flashbangs and the pistol. It'll all become clear in just a second. So, let's go fucking uh, fuck up Birkin. But I need to go get the magnum parts first. So, we'll go do that real quick. Um, now, I have to admit, it's 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 funny because looking back on my older playthroughs of this, when I, you know, when I was first, like, you know, this game when first came out and that, it's interesting looking back now, seeing that, you know, the, the, the amount of ammo <laughs> I put into fucking Birkin in, in taking him down uh, in Juno's, but I, I think there's one... Particular one, I think it's the the Epic Games video. I think it was. I I did. It was no the Gillette no the Gillette one. Sorry, not the Epic Games. Um, the Gillette advert one. You can see that I was just like pumping shotgun rounds into him, and that's literally what I used to do. I used to use my use my pistol and my shotgun rounds to take him out, and it was not a good option. It was not a good uh good, good strategy at all. 
So I, I found this other strategy where it's like you just use your knife, and it's it's true. I thought I was like, no way, you could just use your knife and just take it down. But you can if you just if you just time it right when he grabs you to equip your stuns or your grenades, you're pretty much fine. You could literally take him out with just a pistol. It's pretty fucking sick. And that's even I that even goes for for hardcore as well, which is really interesting. That's right. We'll stick that in there. Keep that in there for now. And then we'll go deal with fucking big fucking Birkin. Daddy O Birkin. Go fucking mess him up. Now, just looking through my notes here, it, I, I do want to briefly say that, you know, if I was to pick between which is the more superior game in terms of, like, the original, the remake, I would definitely say it's the original. I do like the remake, and I really enjoy it. I think it's really good. But I think the flaws of it hold it back quite a bit. And compared to the original, I mean, you're getting four games for the original than you are compared to this, where it's it's still two games, but I mean, it's still I mean, it's still technically four games, but it's all all the scenarios are the same. You know what I mean? Whereas the original, it's it's all very different. They're all quite different, and every choice that you make in each uh, particular playthrough, you know, affects your your next playthrough sort of thing. And you'll see that once I what, if I ever do a original RE2 playthrough. All right, here we go. Gonna go wreck Birkin. Yeah. What the? Oof. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. Leon is pretty fucking solid. Either that, that fucking chest armor of his, you know, the chest pad, like you know, took a lot of that impact. I can't imagine that did any good for his back though. Jesus. 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 Jesus hates Christ. No, they will not indeed. Uh, what have I got equipped? I've got my flashbang. Okay, that's fine. So yeah, if you just shoot him in the head a few times until his eye opens, and then once he grabs you, you use the grenades, um, and then you've, you're pretty much sorted, really. You just keep knifing him. Come on. I mean, again, if you see my first playthrough, you'll know uh, what I mean by that. No choice. Gotta take it down. No choice. Gotta take it down. Come on, open that fucking eye of yours. There we go. <laughs> my G! I love it, he's like, he's basically saying, my G! Oh, there we go. Come on. Boo you. Sick, right, this is where we can knife him now. And this is why I got the these ones, because uh, even if you lose them, it's not a big deal. Or I mean, once you, you know, he's grabbed you. Ooh. Come on. Yeah. Ooh, right. Switch my grenades. Let's go through. Oh! Where? You are a shite. Whoa! Holy fuck. Come on. Whoa! Oh, you fucking son of a bitch. Okay, I've got the first aid spray. It's fine. There is a few healing items around here. But stop fucking smashing your fucking stick around like a spastic. Oh, there we go. Come on. Take it. Bitch. Hey, hey. Right. There we go. Let's equip that. That's me this year every day. Come on. Whoa. Oh, there we go. Nice. Gone. I kind of thought he was going to go for another grab there, but now we got him. Sick. So, as you can see there, I didn't need to use much ammo. Literally, all I need to use my knives and my, my grenades and my stuns. And I, I guess someone could argue that, oh, you know, aren't you going to need those grenades and stuns later on? But, yeah. So, this is where I think the remake kind of shits the bed a little bit compared to the original because it, again if you played the first playthrough you'll know that you've you've basically just fought Birkin twice like he so you so for example in the in the Claire uh, A scenario you're you fight Birkin he like, mutates in his f first form and then you fight Birkin so he falls down and then as you come here as Leon he comes back here again mutates again into just the first form again attacks you and then falls down again See what I mean? It's really, it's really weird. I don't really know 
why they did it that way, or if maybe someone fucked up, maybe, you know, during writing this or something. I don't really know what exactly happened, but again, compared to the original, this falls very flat on this ass, which is, again, kind of a shame, because, again, I really enjoy the remake. I think it's actually really good. It's just, again, it's got just some flaws, which, eh, you know what I mean, it's to expect. It's not perfect. No game's fucking perfect, really. So, right, I'll use that one healing item right now, so we're not fucking, like, limping all the way. And I think there's another one upstairs anyway, so let's go get that. There we go. Fuck yeah. Leon S. Kennedy. There we go. Ooh, nice. Right. I don't think there's anything around here either. No, there's not. Okay. So let's go up into here. And I go turn that lever and then we'll get on. I think I think I meet Ada in this. I'm actually not in Again, it's been a little while since I played the second scenario, the remake. So this will be interesting. Uh, again, this will be kind of like playing it brand, brand new again. But it's as I mentioned earlier, I, I don't play much of the the second scenario, to be honest. The second scenario is a bit meh. Even though I like it, you know, because you get to fight Birkin right at the end, you know, like the, the you know, on the train and that. But you don't quite have that classic ending like you do in the in the, the original, where it's like, you know, hey, it's up to us to take on Umbrella. Dan, 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 dan. You know, it's fucking all that shit, which is, you know, a mm, bit of a disappointment in my mind. Okay, so I'll take this hit pouch. Go drop all this shit into here. I should stick the grenade in there as well, because I'm not going to need that, or that. Uh, where the fuck's my shotgun? Here we go. I'll fucking duck it. Oh, I shall just combine that right now, actually, while I'm at it. There we go. Right, stick that in there. Sword, right. Booyah. So we'll save here. Just, I'll just use that one. There we go. Alright, sick. Right, so we need to go up into fucking... Up into the bit. The garage area. So, I think I'm going to leave it there for now. Uh, so this one I'm not going to leave for months on end. And then not complete. I will actually... I'll probably pick this up again tomorrow. Uh, but for, for now, I'll edit these videos. Edit, edit these parts and then put them out. So again, tell me what you guys think. Tell me what you guys think of the new mic. If it sounds alright. If it sounds too loud. Whatever. Uh, you know, tell me what you think. And, uh, yeah, so as always, guys, you know, like and favorite this video, uh, subscribe to the channel, subscribe to both my YouTube channel and my BitChute channel. For the YouTube, uh, click the little bell uh, notification, because then you get notified when I'm making videos. Uh, follow me on all my relevant social medias, like Twitter, Instagram, Parler, all those stuff, all links will be in the description for you. And, uh, yeah, so I hope you enjoy this, guys, and I will see you in the next uh, episode. So, as always, guys, you take care, and, uh, as always, guys, adios amigos, and goodbye, guys.